Okie doke. Uh, let's turn this light on. I'm back after losing two games in a row, and my hair is also losing. Uh, oh, and I have a new background. I should show YouTube my new background. Well, it's a work in progress, or maybe, maybe that's what it's going to look like for the rest of time. Anywho, um, all right, we're tied with HastyBot. That means that computers are threatening to take over the universe. Um, but luckily, my counterpart, Mac, counterpart, Mac Miller, uh, is destroying, thoroughly destroying HastyBot in my stead. Um, once again, I'll have his channel in, I think, every description because he started this sort of series. I thought I could one-up him, but... <laughs> I'm getting killed out here. All right, let's let's play hasty again. Let's go back here. Let's go. All right, play a computer. All right, I'm first this game. Um, I think I'm going to play... What am I going to play, actually? It's like, this looked like a good rack, but now... I'm wondering, like, how do I play the H and the K? I don't see how I'm supposed to do that. How do I play the K and the V? I don't think I can do that. How do I play the H and the V? I just don't see a way to do any of those things. So if I wanted to, I could play verse 24 and keep the KH combo. And that could potentially work out for me um scores decently and the k and the h can go well together uh instead i could also play rev for 12. um a bit more of a conservative approach keeping my s um and yeah giving a bit less back to hasty and yeah this looks better than verse probably but it's, it seems pretty close uh, and the other option I have is exchanging the K and the V. Um, so if I exchange the K and the V, I'll be keeping E, E, H, R, S, which is a pretty good leave. It's not a great leave. Uh, I do have the duplicated E in there. But I'd rather have an A or an I. I think I would make that decision a bit uh, more willingly if I had two separate vowels. Um, so yeah, it seems close between those two options, rev and exchanging. And verse also seems pretty close, honestly. Uh, is there, I mean, Shrek isn't a word. Yeah, um, I'm liking rev. I'm not really sure though. Uh, it's a very different play than the exchange. The exchange is basically going straight for a bingo. Um, and usually with exchanges like KV, keeping EHRS, you're looking at like how many seven letters your words you're drawing with like normal draws. And if I draw two vowels, I don't think I'm getting a seven letter word a lot of the time. So I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna shoo that and I'll play rev. Let's see what happens. All right. Well, um, AC about bingo and I didn't draw a vowel. I, I'm actually like close. If I had an I open, I could play kitchens, I think. Um, Shockets. I don't think there's a word with the O. I'm going to be too sure about that. And um, with the E, oh, okay. Well, the moment I put that on my my notepad, speaking of notepads, um, I found the bingo. It took me a long time, but I didn't miss it at least. So that's good. Um, that's 118 points for that. Uh, definitely needed to see that. I'm glad I did not miss it. Uh, though I should have seen it faster. Whatever. 
I saw it. So here I drew a blank, which is nice. Uh, so I'm gonna look for some bingos. Um, through the S, let's see. There could be something through the S. Um, not seeing anything immediately. Sub, pod. I don't know. There might not be any bingos here. I'm gonna look for a bit. Uh, with that E, I mean, it would be better if the E were further down the board. We'd be likely to get something. Um, yeah, I don't see it through the E either. And H doesn't look so great. And so now I'll be looking for nines uh, through the E and the N. That's not an E. So maybe something with N E D. It looks quite close to something. Um, contained. I don't see it. And yeah, from the G, it's pretty easy to tell. I don't think I have anything. Uh, through the AR, there's like board, like pain board or something like that. Could be a word, but probably not. And when we're starting to look through these two letters, like it's pretty close to the end of our search. Um, because a, a, a nine letter word through the DE or the AR is not going to be that much better, if better at all than bipod, which is a play that I saw pretty quickly in this position. Um, Yeah, I'm just going to do this for a little bit. This, yeah, just the B and the P make it really difficult. Pod. All right, uh, I don't see anything. Is there something through this K that I'm missing? D-A-K-O. I don't see it, so I think I'm going to just play bipod. I'm not up by so much, so taking some points and trying to extend my lead is a good idea. Maybe I'll be able to bingo next turn with this S or through the D or something. We'll see. Um, also worth noting that if there was some seven letter word it would have to have an O in it very close to the front. I can take a little bit of time looking for that but I really don't think there is anything. Yeah I could very well be missing something. All right uh, let's do bipod. So, uh, hasty plays Q, we're going to bingo this turn. I have at least divigate uh, and indigate. I feel like this A-A-D-E-G-I-T blank combination came up recently. Divigate and indigate. And agitated. Um... So I might have something even better. Agitated, divigate, um, and indigate. 
probably want to play Indigate. But I'm not actually sure about that. Yeah, I've already taken almost half of my time, so time is of the essence. So either of the plays, Indigate or Divigate, will suffer putting a vowel next to a triple letter score. That's good. I think this is a verb, so we'll take a D and an S. And although placing the T and the E here inhibits seven letter words from playing. It doesn't do a great job at inhibiting seven letter words from playing. Uh, might even just give them some five to 10 extra points. Um, and by playing into gates instead, um, opening a bit less space on the bottom and I'm blocking the G from ever being a problem. And I'm creating spots for a Q if I draw a lonely Q or even an X, neither of which uh, Hasty has has with the play of Q. So I'm gonna do this. Hopefully, I'm not missing something, but this looks pretty good. And Hasty again playing off two vowels. Very fortunate that it's doing a whole bunch of nothing in this game. Um, so here, try to get rid of the J. I might not be able to do so very easily. Oh, I have jump. That's pretty good. Jump for 30, TRL blank. It's hard to imagine a better play in this position. I started by looking for a six letter word ending in I, starting in J. But I didn't see one. I still don't see one. So yeah, let's play jump. It doesn't accomplish anything other than leaving us with really good letters. And he seems to have drawn a W and a G in this last pull. That's uh, interesting. Um, so we drew only one vowel, which makes sense since Hasty was playing a lot of them. Um, and we kept three consonants. So one vowel, two consonant pull is basically the most normal three tile pull you can imagine. Uh, do I have a bingo though, like trollic or... Even if I have something down here, it's probably not worth doing to open a triple triple when I'm ahead by over a hundred with a blank. So I'm going to stop looking for that. Um, and yeah, I'd like to maybe play to this A. I don't think I can. So I could do something like Turl, which sort of inhibits this spot, but does create a better S hook, I guess. Um, there doesn't seem to be much to do here. And I'm just unloading stuff I don't want or I don't need. Rictal. Uh, I could do something also like till 13, a slightly higher score, but slightly better leave as well. Although there are lots of R's to, to come. This also inhibits this scoring spot. If hasty drew next, it no longer will fit, fit for so much. And yeah, the CR combo is pretty good. Um, yeah, I'm partial to this, I guess. Even though Turl does inhibit this, this end column, I'm happy. If hasty plays on the end column, I should just be able to triple triple at the very best but uh but is there something maybe here taking too long aren't i all right let's play till 
doesn't really do any bad things to the board. All right, hey, Steven goes with internees. Um, now it's within 50, but drawn some good stuff myself. Moronic Omicron. So Micron will fit here and Moronic will fit here, but those do open triple triples. What about not opening a triple triple? How about that? Orsonals. This is a problem with not leaving myself enough time. Um, if I miss a if I miss a better bingo, it might cost me the game. I'm in such good position. Five minutes left, 31 in the bag. Yeah. What's worse, the C or the L there? I think the L is worse. Um, Neutralic, Orlonic. All right, I don't see a bingo with an S. And I'm running low on time. I'm going to do this and just hope I don't get triple triple through a C. Seems very unlikely. I could lose some other way as well. All right, that's an incredible draw. Uh, and triple triple is dealt with. Um, so I don't have like in immediate and like death blows here. Just do redox. Yeah, pretty much anything should be fine here. I have such high scoring potential for the next few turns. Redox. So Frey, um, I can just play Za whenever I want. Um, have one as well. Yeah, Za is not like a great play. I might as well probably do something like that. Do one, but yeah, I'd like to play off W A U L. I guess I could do this. Um, although the Q is unseen, so yeah, we could play slow. I'm gonna just play Zah. All right, now I think I'll just do allow. If I draw the Q, I get souk. This does set up an H or a T, but I'm up 100. Yeah, seems hard to lose anyway. If I don't draw the Q, Hasty's drawing the Q. Although, Did it have some crazy quiet word in quiet? I mean, it could just have quiet. Yeah, this might not be right. Um, maybe I'll just play ow, ow for 30. Still leaves less than seven in the bag, so I'm not gonna get it on twice. All right, himbo, and look at this unseen stuff. Um, so if I, I could go for an N, um, try to bingo out. 
I don't see how to open a spot to do that. So I could just do halls. If I draw, if I keep the A, I have QAI and QAID. So what if I just do halls? Um, this is not at all the best, probably, but I guess the job done. If I draw the Q, I have spots for it. Uh, if I don't draw the Q, I have outplays with pretty much everything. All right, let's do it. All right, drew the V. I'm going to go out with valet with time to spare. Okay, kind of a weird game. Uh, I just took a really long time and I very well have missed a lot of stuff, but stayed in control, I think. Um, so we're not going to be behind now, at least. Hasty is not going to have two games on us. Um, so let's rematch and try ourselves again. Hasty is first and another opening bingo of Realgar uh, in a very funny spot. We love to see that. Um, Now my question is, is Katsura a word? I think it is. This looks like it has a bingo in it. So I think I'm going to play Katsura and Realgers. But if I'm wrong, I might get hit with an S at Hasties. Katsura. What would I be mixing that up with? So there's Katsina. Um, Taraux. Autarks? Oh, maybe it's Autarks. Oh God. Well, yeah, that might be, it might be Autarks. All right, so if I play Autarks and I'm wrong and Hasty has an S, then I think the bingo is Katsura and I'll be able to play it. But if I play Katsura and I'm wrong and Hasty has an S, Autarks is not gonna, not gonna have a spot. Oh god, I don't know which is which. All right, well, like we know, I make a lot of word knowledge mistakes in these series, but I still try to make the best play um, until I get too upset with myself. Autark. Why would it be spelled that way? All right, it has to be then Katsura. If I'm wrong about this too... Okay. Oh, and for Zandi, setting up another S hook. Oh my god. Ah, I should have gone with my original idea. Now I'm down 70, and there's another huge S hook. This one might be as huge as the other one. Oh gosh. All right, well. Have to hope Hayes doesn't have an S, I guess. Out. Man, this rack looks almost good. Out earned, out dared, out. Should have just gone with my original word that I saw, but oftentimes that's wrong. I guess I could inhibit this S hook. Um. Yeah, what to do. I could also fish. Try to hit a bingo ending in ED or something. But yeah, this is pretty bad. I guess I could do undo. Oh, 
looks just so rough. But yeah, and there's no real great way to get rid of this S hook. I could play duo and it's a bit harder. Um, yeah, I might just leave it open. I need some help to win this game. I can't just totally block the spot. I mean, I can. I can play like a D here. Play Odia. Keeping TNU. But that's what a scared player would do. And they might be right to do it. Um. Do Udon instead of Undo, probably slightly better. I think like Autarky is a word, and that's the confusion. Um, duo, I mean, the D really helps my lead. Helps bingos to play. Hmm. All right, I'm doing this. I don't know. Oh, Inti. Okay, so this four zombie is just not going to happen. That's unfortunate and fortunate at the same time. All right. Um... I drew EEU. Yeah, Eluent on steel. I don't have anything here that keeps AE. I have Lutia. Keeping EEN. With exchange. Um. Under I have EAU somewhere. I guess EAU is probably better. Sometimes hard to see hard to see EAU on your rack. Um and I guess I have this D to play two, I guess. Yeah, and this other D. Alright, I'm gonna do this. Keep the balance. Hasty exchanges. I draw two more E's. Huh. So I guess I could just play the two E's off. G? Or I could exchange them, leave the board as is. So we'll let us go here. One, the B, the F, the G, the L, the M. E R T W X. It's ten letters. More letters go here. But AC does play down here on the L column. It will give me more opportunities. And I'm not blocking this L. <laughs> yeah, I don't really know. Uh, I think I either exchange EE or play EE. I'm just fishing here. I'm down 60 still. But what do I prefer? Do I prefer a play down here? Not really. But nine points are nine points. Yeah, I'll do this. So promoted comes down for 18, and that's just very defensive. That's unfortunate. Um, we miss again. Here I could just do Wayne. I could even do Twain. Sorry, I could do Twain. I could even do Wayne is what I meant to say. Uh, Twain will take an A hook, which is nice. Um, 
Yeah, at this point, I think I need to just score a bit more. I guess I could also play NT. No, I can't. OT. That OT always getting you. Um, yeah. One letter off of Kintar. So I think, yeah, I mean, between Wayne and Twain, I think I just have to score nine more. Pool is very constant heavy now. Yeah. I'm going to do Twain. Man. Well, I was getting hit with that rack no matter what. Um, all right, that's very bad. Um, what do I have here? I'm down 119. Lychee, EH, and now a Twain is useless. So what happens when you lose turns, usually? If it doesn't happen, consider yourself lucky. Uh, it's funny how I decided to play Autarchs. Just based on the way the board was shaped, nothing else. All right, um, I think I'll just score. Try to hit the C next turn or whatever. Um, see what happens. All right, that's good for us. Let's open S hook. Although, I don't have anything close to Keyblaze now. And I still don't have anything to this C that I see. So the sun is setting as as some would say, on this game. Um, Ibises. Yeah. Vice, bile, I mean, bile is just giving up on having S hook, but maybe I have to just use it. Do I have? I don't think that's a word. So I have Ivis, but once I play that, where is it? what's happening? What am I supposed to do? E E, keeping the same leave as last time. Hoping for a better result. You lie, hoping that Hasty has like terrible, terrible letters. I'm down 115, wow. <laughs> Just want to get out of this game. But I also want to try and win it, because I can still win it. Billy. No, it's 12 vowels, 21 consonants. That's pretty normal. A little bit consonant heavy. So I guess my plan here is to play this, score points, draw the blank eventually, keep scoring, and somehow get back in the game. Um... Of course, now that I've played off my eyes, it's very hard to hit the C um, for any points. Hmm. So how do I score points now? Don't really see a way to, other than just playing Go. Uh, which was the wrong game, but 
Hey, we like all the games in the Scrabble community. Um, shout out to all the Go fans. All right, let's just keep trying to score. Yeah, AC did have the blank. Okay. We tried. Had the S as well. I figured as much with a play like Fry that something was happening. All right. Um, not much to do here. I think I'll just play Vi. Yeah. I don't know. Just take away the triple. Although it's not really a very dangerous one. Thais to the X. I could play like Telext. And if, I mean, the problem is after I play like Thais, Hasty is going to have something in this spot. But yeah, I don't think I'm winning. Um, yeah, it must have vowels with that play. Otherwise, I might do something like X. Hmm. Yeah, I'm still trying to win somehow, but it's not happening. He sees too many vowels. I guess. How do I prevent it from playing through the T? What would it have to not play through the T? Probably not much of anything. If it has the J, it's just blocking. Okay. Um, man, I've had this G for too many turns. Yeah, I'll try this, and if somehow some AC doesn't block triple triple, I'll win if I draw one. Yeah, blocked. I didn't draw one. Surprise. Um. Now, does it have any outplays? So, so I'll just do this. That blocks bog. So, what was my next best option? Play God. That hasn't been working out for me. Uh, that's nine. He goes eight. And yeah. Looks like I will be going out for nine points and congratulating Hasty for once again challenging off my phony, winning the game. I need to shake those off. So Katsura, Sidious Tree of Japan and China. So Realgar obviously is better to be played anywhere else on this board if you're trying to win. But this worked out super well for Hasty. I had Katsura for one of seven and decided that Autarks was going to be my try. And yeah, for Zandi, um, taking an S is just really cool. Um, never seen that happen on a board. So yeah, I don't know, maybe I should have played like Taiwan. Taking some more points here. The AENT leave is not very good. 
Um, yes, for zombie. I wonder if there are any words that still fit here. I don't think so. Yeah, you looks fine. At this point, I'm just like, even if I play the best moves every turn, it's probably not going to be enough because I just lost a turn earlier. Yeah, so. Seems like I played well other than the phony, so whatever. Um, not much to look at. Whereas here, I actually don't think I played well. Um, the first two turns were fine. Oh. <laughs> there was a, a nine letter word. Okay, so this one is... This one might actually not be as good as Bipod. All right, I have to export this game. Carbidopa, I feel like I've seen that before. Never would have found it, obviously. Didn't. Um, that's the only thing on the position. I'm going to run a simulation. Let's see if indeed um, my play is almost as good, if not as good. Because uh, the problem with Carbidopa is this huge spot here, even gives a Z spot and like a big S hook, but mostly this spot here. Um, but the difference in equity is 10 points almost, so. Huh. And also, once Hasty plays here, the board is pretty dead. I can play around up here no matter what, and. Yeah, you're going to have to draw an S to come back. So, yeah, Carbidopa, Carbidopa is probably the best play. Um, but Hasty, or not Hasty, Quackle, simulation is telling me that my choice might be three points better. I don't know if I believe that, but apparently I am giving back ten more points on average next turn than after Bipod. So who knows? It seems pretty close. I wish I would have seen that. And yeah, based on Hasty's play of G-E-Y, probably doesn't really have the tiles to go underneath. So I really think Carbidopo is probably correct. Sad. And yeah, I t <laughs> Oh man, I did miss a triple triple. Lady eight, really? There are so many eight letter words. Oh, that's so bad. I'm sorry, everybody. It's not not been playing well against this thing. Um yeah, okay. So coloring was could have been obvious, I and G. Uh, that would have prevented triple triples from happening. So that was the only bingo that didn't open a triple triple. So that's arguably a pretty big mistake. But then I was just drawing too well. Really couldn't, couldn't lose. Could have played Walla, yeah. Um, and yeah, end games, pre end games, not very important. All right, so yeah, not very well played at all on my end. Um, it's now 44 games in. I have six games to prove myself against this bot, and uh, we'll see. We'll see if I can get some good games in. Um, thanks for watching, as always. Um, keep getting better at Scrabble. I sure am not. Um, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. See ya.